L9. L9 in the defense is up. 14. Dear Gary, the victors, written in 1898. That's true. All right, Bill. Has inspired Michigan fans for almost 100 years. The song has been a part of me for 46 of my, my 61 years. New Year's Day, 1993, added an entirely new dimension to those stirring strings. I know that whenever I rise to sing those lyrics again, I'll have to swallow down a, li a, little, lump in my, a little lump in my throat. No playwright could possibly invest, uh, invest those words with meaning that gained, the, the meaning it gained that day. The Michigan team, to a man, gathered before the full marching band in the corner of the great arena, allotted all to their parents and to the Michigan faithful, let it all hang out for all of us to see and to join. The victors was sung as, as it was never been sung before. This was a once in a lifetime experience for anyone who was a part of it. This can never be done again. Every future Michigan team can try to do something similar. Notre Dame might try to win one for the Gipper. To, the, to sing the victors in the Rose Bowl. Let that be the standard. Let that be the standard for those who come to continue the Michigan tradition. Let that be the standard for those who come to continue the Michigan tradition. Your friend and fan, Bob Bunny. Bob lives in Fremont, Ohio. There's a lot of truth to that. There's a lot of truth. Now, unfortunately, as I told Dr. Ravelli before, I think by that time in the road, we were a little off key. We needed you to get that pitch up a little bit. It would have helped a great deal. The gentleman, again, is very, very proud to, to you know, in his own right, he is, he is nothing different than what we all are as coaches. He was a great coach. And, and as everyone around the world will tell you, he had the greatest fans in the country, and I know he's very proud of them. And I know another thing. He was one of the damn toughest band directors <coughs> there was in the country as well. My pleasure to give you again Dr. Bill Rebell. Yep.
where you have the opportunity to play with 400,000 on Saturdays. What some other to <coughs> have those facilities, this magnificent facility. I know you must appreciate all this. If you don't, for God's sake, see a psychiatrist, you've got a problem. <laughs> <laughs> because your quest is so many wonderful things. You're attending one of the greatest universities in the land. You're coached by the greatest coaches. You have the greatest facilities and the greatest tradition. And that doesn't appeal to you and doesn't impress you. I'm sure you got your will. <coughs> the Victors is a simple song. Back to the Victors, there's only four measures in the whole community, in the whole course. Four measures. Not more than 12 notes. Hail to the victor's battle. Hail to the conquering hero. Hail, hail, the Michigan, the leaders and vets. Now that repeats. You say it again. You sing it again. Hail to the victor's battle. Hail to the conquering hero. Hail, hail to Michigan, the champions of the West. Now, when it was written, we were the West. <coughs> we still call the Western Congress. But that was far west as you ever went. Today, it's Roosevelt. Who knows what tomorrow is? Maybe it'll be Paris or something. But at any rate, this song is so simple. But you have no problem learning because the same notes a second time as they are the first. There's a few little problems. Be sure that you say it and you sing hail. I've heard it when it didn't sound like hail. It sounded like, I'm not talking about pitch or tone or anything. I'm talking about my pronunciation of the word. Hail to the Victor's Valley. Hail to the Sounds like hell. <laughs> Doesn't it? Hail to the Victor's Valley. Hail to the... So be sure you say hail. A long A. <coughs> now there's long notes and short notes. The first note is this <coughs> one. And we have six notes this long. And we have this one. And there's a little accent, a little uh, rule right here. The longer the note, the more the tone. Hail! You don't say hail. Hail to the victor's valiant. Hail to the... You notice that way. When I conduct it, I conduct this one. <laughs> and those, those there's another little room, the longer the note, the louder the tone. The shorter the tone, the note the shorter the tone, and that's all. Hail to the Hail. Hail. Now I'm a violinist. <laughs> <laughs> they take the bow off and they both were long. Hail! Hail! Now, if you can do this, gentlemen, it'll give every indication that you're more than football players, that you're also musicians. But if you just sing it, and then the next are five elements. Tone, intonation, means singing in tune, rhythm, singing in rhythm, interpretation, and the next one is spirit, drive, energy, vitality. Nothing bores me more than look up into the stands and somebody singing, hail to the 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 hail to Hail to the, or with their hands up like that. I suppose you do. 
Now then, but there's one thing, the first time I heard a football team sing <coughs> was in the Lions Club, the Union, this is years ago. And I said to the assistant director, I said, So we'll take the pictures. How many of you do not know the words? Or oh, you better. All right. Everybody knows. <coughs> learn them in five minutes. How many of you have heard the Michigan <coughs> band at the Michigan State before you came to Michigan? Play the pictures. Pretty good. How many of you are from Wisconsin? <coughs> You've got a pretty good fight song, too. Long, Wisconsin, long, pretty good. How many are of you from Indiana? Indiana, my Indiana, Indiana, all for you, pretty good. How many are from Northwestern? Oh, you, Northwestern. How many of you are from Illinois? We're loyal to you, Illinois. La da di da 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 The Indian chief, right? A very good Indian chief. So when you visit these schools, they come here, it behooves you, boys, to get a little acquainted with the fight song of that particular school. By the way, if you do, I think it helps you to fight a little hard. <coughs> because the words to those songs are just as strong as the words to our pictures. Where the difference from is the melody, the simplicity. So, I'm going to give you a picture, you'll part, part my voice. And I don't want to get into this, but I'm just recovering from two heart attacks, and I'm not quite up to par yet. I'm getting better every day, a little more strength. Now, so my voice sounds a little like the squad here years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Hail. Now, remember, don't close your mouth and say, Hail. Hail. Keep the mouth open for that one word. Hail. Now, give me that pitch. Not too loud. Hail. Hail. Oh, my hands are here. I don't think we have more than one on it. Now, Looking at your faces, 
Now there's another thing about music. Music starts from within. You don't play a clarinet or a trumpet. You play upon it. It starts from within you, and you feed that to that instrument. It'll give you whatever you give it, and nothing more, nothing less. So one thing in the singing, if you watch the great singers like Pavarotti or Kuga, watch the faces, and they're living what they're singing. The words are coming out from inside. Uh, don't let it become mechanical that you're doing it, thinking whether it's on pitch or whether it's right. Do it because you feel it. You have to think about the stadium, the crowd, the game, the score, the meaning of all of this, all the hard work you put in, and all of the wonderful experiences. And if you put that all together, sing. You'll sing with a spirit that you'll never get if you do not do this. Now, I didn't feel that. I didn't feel the spirit. I felt it was a little classical. You know what I mean? It was a little bit subdued, a little bit, well, refined. Now, you can't play for So you don't sing. If this was a serenade or a little love song, that's fine. But it isn't, it's a fight song. Now let's try it again. Hey, give me some. Give me some energy, spirit, drive, vitality. Hail to Hail to the victor's valiant hail. Now, you know what's good? The first word. The rest of it was all. <laughs> hail to the victor's valiant. Every word, every note, every sound is crucial. Hail to the victor's valiant oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
victors valiant, hail to the conquering heroes, hail, hail to Michigan, the champions of the West. Thank you, let's give my hand. Take care and play your hearts out and sing your hearts out. Thank you, John.